More than 100,000 is expected to watch one of just three games this weekend between ranked teams. State of Texas. They run the option to start and lots of running room outside. Devin Neal all the way up. Very few sacks. Here's a swing pass and it's dropped. Might have been a backward delivery by B. 4-0 for the second year in a row. Bean takes off running, out of bounds, short of the first down. And Egan also hurt you on the run. He's run for three touchdowns. Hands it off to Jonathan Brooks. Greg mentioned he's been terrific. Bounce back beautifully the last two weeks. They come up to the line quickly. Ewers over the middle, caught first down. 32-yard line. And he's one of the very best in all of football at it. Ewers to midfield, just a yard shy. It's Mitchell again. Four. They bring pressure, does Kansas. Ewers on target. First down to the third. It happened to him. He walked in the next day and told his staff, I'm glad we lost. Ewers takes off running. Ewers! He will! For passing, then ran it in. The run that might not have happened a few pounds in a year ago. Daniels with some back tightness, did not warm up, did not start. The option again, Devin Neal, another good gainer on the option. There's so it's from the spot, so it's second and ten. Daniel Highshaw. Riley Leonard, terrific quarterback, and obviously Duke familiar with Sam Hartman, who transferred to Notre Dame from Wake Forest. Jonathan Brooks. Weapons started in the game. Play fake to Brooks, and now a screen to Brooks. Brooks tackles. Lance Leipold said we have to tackle in the open field. Ewers on target again. Xavier Worthy. Of all time. Another first down, and Jordan Winnington almost broke the tackle. Four first-round picks, and he says Banks will be another. Ewers under a blitz, got it off. To Tavion Sanders, chopped down. And he is eight out of nine for 108. Brooks up the middle, and surges ahead for a first down. Just about to start his senior season of high school football. Ewers over the head of Whittington. To Shorty last week against Baylor from 26 yards. This one's good from 26. Affect him moving forward. And you know it must be significant because he'd be out there if he could be. Highshaw got splattered but got the first. First and ten, final minute. Here comes a blitz off the corner. Bean got away and throws for a first down and much more. The option again, it's worked well. Bean keeps it this time. Shows that speed. And then he got rocked, fumbled. Highshaw picked it up. Out of the game, they go really deep down the depth chart. They cannot afford to lose him. 10-7 Texas a year ago. He and Sanders the likeliest to win it this year. Here's Jonathan Brooks. He may go. And they run. 17 years of Lance's tenure as a head coach around college football. Out wide Baxter trying to make a man miss, and he cannot. Good tackle by Richmond is no joke. Bird Auburn with his second field goal of the game. That one from 30 yards. In the meeting yesterday. But on first down, Jonathan Brooks. Wow. That's eight. Brooks again. Nice bounce. He has great balance and he is powerful as well. And to win it right now. Yours the fake. Given plenty of time, has his man. It's Mitchell again. Chopped down at the from its own 19. 
And Xavier Worley made a man miss and got eight. There's the Bobby Dodd Stadium in Midtown Atlanta. Brooks for a first down. And now the time of factor under two and a half. Fire a timeout. Absolutely. Texas will get the ball to open the second half. Ewers, Mitchell! First down. Ewers with pressure in his face. Man open, Whittington. Runs out of bounds, retreated. Fake the inside handoff. Ewers, intercepted for the first time in forever. Another. The coaches appreciate Dotson. His 26th career start. Ewers look like he might get sacked. He lunges, and he has the first down. Two in his first interception of the season. Brooks! Goodbye! Jonathan Brooks! Touchdown! He had a 67-yard run earlier. Now he has a 54-yard touchdown. 180 yards and a 13-point left again from Kansas. Worked so well in the first half. Beautiful throw by Bean. Jason Bean on target to Jerry. That's been. They're going to keep trying that deep ball. And this time they're on target. Touchdown. 2021 against Baylor. Yeah, an early drop here today. Took that one in. 20 to 14. Te Third down and three. Texas has not punted today. Over the middle. Good catch by Mitchell. And he gets the first down. Put the brakes on right. Four receivers go out into the pattern. Beautiful throw. Worthy got belted along the far sideline, but play. Four and a half sacks already this season for Robinson. Ewers on target again. John T. Cook after the catch. They spot the ball back at the 28. Problem with the snap. And Brooks falls on it, but a big loss. Back to the 40. Get it all, or they try to get close enough to try a field goal and take a two-score lead. Ewers flushed. Back over the middle. Nice catch by Mitchell. They do get into field. They have their own 39. They had trouble on the handoff. Looked like Bean wanted to keep it. High shot didn't. Side to the left. It just looked like it was very late to try to yank it away. And now Brooks. Looked at what he had in front of him. Been convinced he was going to make it. Brooks ripping through the defense now. Do you wonder if they're a little... C.J. Baxter, Baxter yanked down just shy of the goal line. Scored a touchdown on a catch against Wyoming. Leading the way for Brooks, huge hole. Quinn Ewers on the design roll. Lobs it back in the end zone, incomplete. They have to be. I mean, and this offensive line is a big, physically imposing group. I mean, the fake to Baxter, wide open receiver, look out, Xavier Worthy and Kobe Bryant rushing, 253 passing, 528 through three quarters, and you can add to that total on the completion, Quinn Ewers to Xavier. Going against one of the best in the Big 12 and Kobe Bryant. Here's Baxter. And they're just getting it in big chunks now. OJ a much better player this year. A lot of talent around him. Third and eight. End zone touchdown. Nine Mitchell adds a touchdown for the Longhorns. Texas Longhorns against this talented and pesky Kansas team. Mitchell the touchdown. Ewers the... That's the home field advantage. <laughs> Get your sideline on the side that gets in the shade first. Brooks. That's another first down. And enormous. Lance Leipold said the rules then were you really can't work out with your team. You're really not supposed to watch them in the summer. Here's a screen. Baxter breaks a tackle. And gets taken down. Idea, the players, of what they were doing on each side of the ball. Ewers on target. They're not taking the foot off the gas pedal here. Texas over 600 yards of offense for the game now. Worthy juggling catch. 
And he steps across the football playoff aspirations, trying to make it a more impressive win. Catch made, Mitchell diving toward the end zone. The ball came out. He's ruled down at the one. Alabama in the fourth quarter, 40-yard score. Good fake by Ewers. Running for the pylon. Diving for the pylon. Yeah, you're playing about all the run play, but you're actually going to fake it and carry it out. You're the only one that's going to know that, so don't tell anybody. Sarkeesian. Great quarterback coach. Brilliant play caller. Neal, the catch, lunges for what appears to be made an immediate impact at Texas. He was their leading tackler in the win at Alabama with seven. Being incomplete out of bounds. Pete Kwiatkowski tells us to nose for the ball, still learning in terms of technique. And he finds a way to make plays. Good throw. <laughs> Mason Fairchild. Shovel pass to Neal. Lawrence Native. Xavier Worthy, you're in for a long day. Malik Murphy, the backup quarterback, is in. Jaden Blue, the uh, backup Mason. runner. Down to two minutes to go. Here comes Blue again. And frustrated he didn't get more but you were transferring back home was obviously a huge development Wisner in the rank number three with another win over likelihood possible playoff bird here's Molly now let's send you to the studio with Kevin Nagandi and Booger McFarland so long everyone